Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the next part of Super Mario Land 2 for the Game Boy Pocket. Before we get to our next zone, let's go on ahead and uh, complete this level first. It's one of our many side-scrolling uh, levels and uh, it's really not that difficult. I mean, there's some blocks that can get in your way, there's some Goombas, uh, Fire Flower, I don't want to get that. I think I'll keep a hold of my uh, rabbit suit, to be honest. But I mean, like I said um, in the last part, if you stomp on a hundred of these uh, enemies, you'll gain a star. And that's always nice, because that can actually help us get one-ups. And again, you know, it's really easy to gain these one-ups, you know? Now see, <coughs> again I don't feel particularly guilty of using the emulator because I actually own a copy of this game on the Virtual Console on my Nintendo 3DS. And yes, I play this game time to time. And uh, yeah, it's really fun. Now, to get to the Moon Zone, we actually have to go through this level first and keep a hold of this air bubble. And, uh, you know, it's really easy, uh, you know, controlling the air bubble. I mean, all you have to do is hold the jump button to ascend and just let go of it just so you can descend. Oh, it's those guys again, huh? Kind of remind me of those, um, <coughs> urchins from Kirby's Dream Land. <laughs> but that's just me. Just, you know, just stick to the you know the top path and you'll be able to make it you will be able to make it to the next zone because there's actually two exits here you have to take the top exit to um, get to the next zone if you take the bottom path you just complete the level you don't go to the next area at all so let's take the top path and we'll get to the space zone and the space zone well you know, it's definitely space, you know, it definitely feels like your gravity is like really fucked up here, or your momentum, because you can't really run in any of the levels of these stages at all, so uh, that's really one thing, and there is a secret level in this area, yes, yes there is. Um, to get there, we're going to have to um, take one of these pathways, well not pathways, you see that robot that's just floating around like, right there? He's actually, he's actually hovering around the hidden block, so once you hit that hidden block, you want to hit the other one, I mean, there should be another one, you have to hit it exactly. Oh man. Oh, it was just right on top of that. Well, what do you know? Alright, now, when you get to this point, you want to time your jumps very good. Jump at the very edge of the platform just so you can just barely make that next jump. Once you do that, you should eventually just keep on doing this until you find a secret exit of Space Zone Level 1 which will take us to the secret level. And that moon is pretty pissed off, so let's go ahead and take care of this secret level and uh, get it over with. Uh, again, these secret levels aren't so bad. I mean, they're filled to the brim of coin. It's, you can consider it like a bonus level of some sort. You just keep collecting these coins after coins after coins and barely have to deal with any enemies whatsoever and I like these kind of levels you know it's it's chill it's fun but uh really not much else to say you know it just gets as basic as it gets you know we're already at the exit already look at that <laughs> oh and that moon is sad now but that's okay that's okay 
Now, let's go on ahead and finish this level proper. And since I don't really have the bunny suit or rabbit ears or whatever, I'll go on ahead and nab me a fire flower if I can find one. I can find one right here actually. Alright. Pretty sure I off screen. Oh no, I didn't. Let's go ahead and get rid of that enemy. And we can jump over here. Get some coins, why not? Like any other Mario game, when you have a fire flower, you can only shoot two at the time. You can only shoot two at a time. So, yeah. Be careful because those are actually spikes. You can get hit if you uh, land on them. So, be careful on that. Oh man. All right. Just barely made that jump. But we can actually go on ahead and you know, finish this level proper. And we can actually get to the last level of Space Zone. Yeah, Space Zone is actually really not that big of a zone. But here's a gimmick here with this level. Kind of like the one where we had to ride that air bubble across the sky just so we can get to the uh, top exit to get to this area. Um, you just press A press and hold A to ascend, let go of A to descend, and you can move around freely. Except the difference is that it is a side-scrolling level, and it's filled to the brim with these moving stars, which can hurt you. So you want to be careful on that. But again, you know, it's really a simple level once you know what you're doing here. You want to keep your fire flower, just in case, you know. <laughs> Not like the boss is very hard. No, he's made a humongous downgrade since our last encounter with him. That should be a huge hint, by the way. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> really not much else to say. Oh man, I just almost clipped myself through there, didn't I? That's okay. Is there actually a check? I don't think there's a checkpoint at all in this level. I know this level takes a little while, so... I'm actually in for a long trial. Oh yeah, see, there's a checkpoint right there. Alright, but that's okay because uh, we're literally almost at the end of the stage to, to ouch, go against our second boss in this game. So, there's that. Let's go on ahead and uh, nab our fire flower and prep up for the boss. And it's Tatengua, the boss from Mario Land? Okay, he's pretty tough in this, uh... Once he, uh... Does his wave of blasting and stuff like that, you may end up taking a couple of hits. But once he swerves to the other side, just bounce on him three times and you should be good. With that said, we actually got our second golden coin from the moon zone. Booyah! Let's see. Actually going ahead, because I actually ha still have a little bit more time to uh, get into our third zone, which is Macro Zone. Macro? Macro? I don't know. Let's just continue here. It's basically our house zone. And, you know, I really love the uh, level design on Macro Zone. You're basically just this little guy. Expo Fuck! <laughs> exploring the uh, outside skirts of the house and then when you go into the house you're actually going through a library and stuff like that and you know, I, I really love that attention to detail on this uh, zone it's actually pretty neat fuck can't believe I died by the same enemy twice Ugh. 
actually, this level is the one that you want to uh, <coughs> go out of your way. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, coughing fit. Um, go out of your way to find the uh, secret exit. Actually, I think that's a bunny suit right there I wanted to get. But uh, we need a fire flower to uh, get the job done. Unfortunately, I don't think I'll find a fire flower here. At least, I don't think so. Whoa. Yeah, that counts as a bottomless pit. So if you uh, jump into the water, uh, you'll die. <laughs> But again, ah, not particularly bad level. Ugh. All right, checkpoint. I'll take that. I guess. I think that's a fire flower up there. I want that. If that's the case, no, it's a carrot suit. Oh, I'll take it. If I can't find a fire flower suit, I'll. Uh, Actually, I think there's a fire flower suit over here. There's not, really? No. No, wait, there's one right here. Alrighty. Good! And no, that's not our secret passageway that's in that pipe. In fact, I don't think I've ever traveled down that pipe before, but you want to keep a hold of this uh, fire flower here and actually climb up here because up here we'll actually uh, find some uh, blocks that we can jump on. Come on, jump up there, Mario. Thank you. That way we can get rid of these blocks, climb up here. And, uh, find our secret exit. Huzzah! And I have a few minutes to spare, so let's go on ahead and get this, uh, level out of the way. Another side-scrolling level over a bottomless pit. How fun. Though the gimmick with this level is, um... No! Uh... Well, thankfully, I can just, you know, keep... We're starting right there, so I guess that's good. I, oh man. Oh well. Guess I'm just doing this as small Mario then. But if you had a f flower suit, if you had a flower suit, the gimmick of this level is you will find those blocks that you have to um, break with the fire flower, you know. And uh, once you break a few of them. Uh, there'll be one ups after one up after one up and uh, it, This is a great way to farm lives if you want my honest opinion See like here we go. Here's the fire flower. I think we're getting to that point to where we need to uh, Break some blocks here. So you like see there we go And then we break these blocks right here do a spin jump Oh man, just barely. Oh man, awesome. All right, but that actually takes us to the last level. But I'm not gonna be—I'm not gonna be cheap and beat the, le the zone just like that. But um, I am gonna go on ahead and end the part right here, ladies and gentlemen. So the next time we meet, we will be actually going through the macro zone. Macro zone? I don't know. And uh, we'll actually be going to our next zone after this one. So, until then, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Blue Hedgehog 2010. Happy gaming, my friends.